middle class. To, to JT yeah. and I can listen to you talk about business forever because I learn things because once you start talking about business I am I am absolutely stepping outside my my sphere of expertise so I love it and uh, talking about the different ways that you can leverage the tax system to your advantage maybe some purchases or deductions uh and and talk about how to to start a business i i love it and i could listen to that all day one of the things you said and i just want to get some clarification on it it, it it was sounding to me and i know this isn't what you said so i'm putting words in your mouth but it was sounding to me that you were kind of saying there should uh, let me just ask you do you do you believe in sex before marriage or i was getting confused when you were talking about premarital right. sex i don't you do not believe that there should be sex before marriage no okay okay and I knew what he meant when he said it, but I, I, I he said, okay, I, okay. <laughs> is that a religious thing or what is the, what is the impetus behind that? Well, it's a, it's a few different things because if you understand women, right? What, let me ask you a question. Why do we ask women? How many partners have they been with? How many? This is about to get done. I just, I just want very yeah, right. audience. It's I'm, about to get I'm telling you, it sounds like a, it's like, it's like an angry black woman is talking right now, man. I'm telling you. It's, this is, it's about to get stupid. It's wow. Wow. Uh, I think it's important for men to, you know, one of the things that a man uh, typically values a woman on is having a low body count, right? Why? Which, why? Right. Well, I think it comes back from evolutionary times. You know, men, we don't want to, uh, we don't want to raise, hey, I don't always get to push back on this, but I'm just going to tell you guys the truth. Really, the guys know it's for the women. Men don't really want to raise another man's child. Now Let's I know assume she don't have kids, but she got a lot of bodies. No, no, Does no, it no. Still matter? Absolutely, absolutely. Why? But, Why? Well, hold a lot. On. What? Hold All right. On, hold on. Your Let's just watch. subconscious Let's just operates on a level that you are not aware of, and your subconscious is going to push you to things that you don't even understand. And your subconscious comes from your genes, from your ancestors, from fifty thousand years ago. Right? Epigenetics. Your, That's called epigenetics. Subconscious is telling you, hey, you know, back in the Serengeti, back on the step, the one of the worst things you could do was raise another man's child. And so those genes have been passed on for generations. Now here you are in 2021 and you have this nagging feeling, you have this suspicion. You can't put your finger on it, but you're laying next to her and you're like, man, she's doing good. And like, has she had a lot of practice, right? You want to know. <laughs> Well, how many has she had? Because this could tell you. Because like you say, you don't necessarily want to be with a woman who's for the streets. Uh, nope, and that's not why. This is painful. I don't I don't see nothing wrong with lead attorney's point at all. I don't I don't know what, what could that but I don't know what you could come up with. But it's Anton Daniels. I mean he pretty much said that's, that though. He pretty much said historically that has always been like so I, I I don't know. Mm. I'm speechless. There's nothing to say, man. I mean, there's nothing to say, really. Lead attorney is on point. What's the he's flaw? What he's, I don't. What's the flaw with the lead attorney? Something, brother, but no, help me. What, what do you say? Lead saying attorney. Lead? I've been watching lead attorney probably since I want to say last August. I like to do, man, because he puts out content and he'll tell you, I put out good stuff and y'all don't want to hear it. This is proof. Now, let's, this, this, this is 100% proof. This is prima facie. Prima yes. facie evidence. Yes. That's uh, not why. Okay, you tell me. Why is it then? Wow. Why is it that a man is interested in his uh, in his woman? Well, it's not, it's not whether he's interested in it. It's the reason why it's important to ask the question, right? The reason why it's That's important. That's not what I was answering. I thought, you were, I thought you were asking me a different question. I thought you were asking me why is it I important said, for the man? why it is it is important for the man to know that that's true that is the question 
but I'm giving you additional context to go along with it, right? Um, did he when he when he when it let's just go back because I don't like that, you know what I mean? Yeah, everybody like what? Wait, who? Mm-hmm. Huh? And it, it's the reason why it's important. Huh? You don't necessarily want to be with the woman who's for the streets. No, nope, that's not why. So is nope, that's not why. Is that I just want to give additional context. Is they the same thing to y'all? No, I, I don't. This is no, seconds no. apart from each other. That's not this is not edited at all. I sound like he tried to like he tried to rephrase his argument, trying to I don't know, kind of make it seem like he just wanted to I guess shifted a little bit. Oh, I, I guess that's what I heard from him. Like he's sitting, he's sitting like this, like I he really said, the, I said the first time. <laughs> Noble, stop! Like this... he about to tear him up when he done. Like he really got something fire for him. I'm trying to figure out is nope. That's not it. Oh my God. Is that is that equivalent to? Uh, I just want to add additional contact or contact. I, I don't, I don't see how they work together like that. Maybe I'm tripping. I don't music. That's not why. Okay, you tell me. That's not why. That's not why. Is what he said. Okay. Why is it then? Why is it that a man is interested in his uh in his woman? Well, it's not. It's not whether he's interested in it. It's the reason why it's important to ask the question, right? The reason why it's That's important not what I was is- answering. I thought you were. I thought you were asking me a different question. I you can't play that game with people that listen for a living. You can't All play right. the, the little. <laughs> It's I'm getting, I'm getting the noble very, face very now. Very it's just getting now. stuck. Like, it's like that surprise face. Like, I'm, I'm serious. Sometimes you just don't have to say nothing, brothers. I learned this at 48 years of my life. Sometimes you just, you just let it go. The, the, I don't have to say nothing. I mean, this is easy for me. I mean, there's nothing to say. Seriously, can't, can't make this. There's nothing up. literally to say. It's mom by this is you can't make this goofy, stupid, retarded, satanic but, shit up. I thought you were asking me why is it I important said, for the man? Why it is? It is important for the man to know. That that's true. That is the question. Okay, what? But I'm giving you additional context to go on. Like I thought you were asking me why is it I important said, for the man? Why it is? It is important for the man to know. That that's true. What? what? That is the question. But I'm giving you additional context to go along. What? Bro, what are you talking about, man? With it, right? The the reason why it's important for a man to know is because the way men and women operate within a sexual environment is different, right? A man can go out and have a sex with a chick and post nut clarity is real and forget her name the very next minute. I mean, in the very millisecond right after it happened, he like, what the heck did I do? Why is this real? Is this a thing? Why Why am I even laying with this chick right now? Like, I need to get out of here as soon as possible. Women are different, right? Every single man that a woman has been with, it it's almost like an imprint, right? Her every move, the way in which she reacts to a man, whether it be just regular in every conversation or sexually, it's basically an impression off of her previous experiences. Are you done? Uh, are, you, are, you, are you done? So, to recap, Lee Attorney said what he said about basically what, it, what it equates to epigenetics over time that men don't want to raise other people's children, that they want to, which implies that they want to push their, uh, what I would say progenitor, uh, their, their genes, that they want to push their genes forward um you also just just that by itself that's fine so through epigenetics through over fifty thousand hundred thousand years dudes don't want to deal with somebody else's child right because we know that's what happens when you have sex anton said no that's not why and then what he (laughs) what he brings equates to a female's perspective he says no and then he also says that he wasn't saying no he was adding a perspective so this is this is the type of stuff that we that that you deal with with this dude whereas we're we're with you regardless of what you say i gotta one up you i gotta 
I, like a single mother, I gotta always be over top of you. I gotta always do the sign language, shame, insult, guilt, and the need to be right. Because it was an insult, it was a shame for the dude. It's like it's the dude's fault that he has post nut clarity. This nigga's talking about coming, and we talking about how many, how many goddamn like you understand what I'm saying? How many yeah. thousands of years of history, and you talking about post nut clarity? It's like everything is from a female envious standpoint, and it's annoying. <laughs> every single one so she's literally not only her body has changed from her being for the streets and again again the question that he actually determined to to was why do guys care about how many chicks how many body how many dudes a chick been with that's what that's what he asked him and he's talking about her body and the impression for her that you're not explaining why a dude cares. He who the fuck? When do we give a fuck about her the impression? We don't be caring about that. I just don't want you to be. Oh, I don't care about the fucking impression you got, lady. I don't want you to be able to say yes to any nigga you may or may not walk past. I'm not thinking about how you impressed by his dick. Like that. I, that's that's the, that's that, that's not the sequence in which I think about the process. That that's always been a weird thing to me. Um, with the especially in these spaces, listening to dudes talk about how to approach the question that you probably don't want the answer to in most situations yeah mm -hmm. in, 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 in which case you know just don't ask the damn question <laughs> you know that's something that a dude really doesn't have to know first of all we're assuming that chicks are going to tell you the truth that's if dumb. you ask them the question right you're right. assuming that Chase going to tell him the truth. Look, nothing, nothing, nothing morphs back into shape quicker than vagina. <laughs> Ain't no imprint. If a baby can't leave an imprint, a man definitely can't leave an imprint. Be the wild horse.